Hey everybody, welcome back. So I have some stuff that I've been picking up at these stores as I've been out running around. I did order two items, or no, three items, and they finally came, so I wanted to share with you some of the stuff that I've been picking up. And I mean, this is a random haul <laughs> from shoes to shirts to other little things to plants to, yeah. So if you are interested in seeing what I've been picking up, then go ahead and stay tuned. If you're new and this is your first time watching my channel, hello, welcome. I'd love for you to subscribe and stick around as I record and post videos often. So one of the first random things, and if you follow me on Instagram, you saw me post Post this is this purple cactus this is so pretty look at that and when I seen it in the it was in my local grocery store and it was $9.99 and when I first seen it I was like okay that can't be real because this color is so vibrant but it's real and all they did pretty much was they just kind of spray painted it with some kind of safe um, paint it says painted uh, by half moon bay that's the company but how pretty is that you guys know i love purple i am thinking about repotting it uh i don't know i may repot it or i might just decorate this pot i'm not too sure what i'm gonna do but this is so pretty and um i was researching it after i purchased it to see you know is this a thing right now and apparently online there's a lot of these plants that you can get in your local nursery and it's something that they're you know i don't know they've been doing just painting some of the cactus and uh yeah and i remember when i used to work at home depot when i would you know be out in the garden area we had some cactus that had some different colors to them that was natural like you know like the red or whatever but not this style and so if you want some kind of a colorful cactus you can go look at home depot in their um, garden section but these are a little bit different and so when i saw this i had to pick this up the next item if you followed me during my walkthrough of home goods you saw me pick up these beautiful scissors that i have not used yet i still have the tags on them and how pretty are those when i seen them in the store uh, I told you guys I was going to get these. I love statement pieces and I just think these are beautiful. Look at that. These are so pretty. How much did I pay for them? They were only $7.99 and to, just to have something like this and to keep for a very long time. I mean, I may even, you know, keep these so long where I'll just pass them down to my daughter. I love stuff like this. So I had to get those. I just had to pick those up. Um, excuse me if the camera shook and then random I was in Target and I saw this and I have never tried this before and it's the Dove body wash mousse and it looks like this and I was interested in it this one is with coconut oil it says also perfect for shaving and it says concentrated two times the use and because it was a mousse i wanted to just go ahead and give it a try it is a body soap but it says that you can use it as um sh for shaving so i want to try this out so i went ahead and picked this up and then also at target um i usually like to scan the back rows to see what i could find on the clearance section and i happened to see these and i got these for my daughter and i just thought they were so cute even though she cannot stand hello kitty anymore she's grown out of that but i was like these were some fortune cookies that is marshmallow scented with fun it says fun fortunes inside of each bath bomb and one two three four five there's five is there down at the bottom no there's five of them in here and i found these for a dollar they were marked down for a dollar i think that was like a dollar twenty but it's in a cute little takeout box and i just thought these were super cute and let me see there's no dpci number on here but they are from target and they was on the clearance section for a dollar twenty and they probably are less now if you find them because i've been holding these for like three days now so i picked those up for her even though she ain't gonna want them but she gonna use them <laughs> i'm gonna save the shoes for last just because just to get into the boxes i have a few shirts and stuff that i want to show you but um i love finding little gowns at walmart and these are only six dollars and 44 cents but this is the pattern and it's just a little gown or whatever and i just thought this was so cute coffee good morning a hug in a mug and it just has all the cute little pictures of coffee all over it and it is just a long gown like that and so that pattern i picked up for 644 and then i also got this pattern 
right here with the cute little cactus all over it same thing pretty much and these are just comfortable to relax in to lay around in um yeah so sometimes i do like to wear those when i feel like i just want to just just lay around so i pick those up and then right here okay i was on the fence about this because i I'm not really, I used to love wearing dresses. I just don't really like them so much anymore. <laughs> but this one I could not pass when I seen it because it has the cover up as well. And this is also from Walmart and I thought this pattern was really, really cute. So you get the sheer uh, little thing on the outside and the ends of the sleeves are kind of like bells and they kind of, you know, it's really flowy. But then you have the matching like camisole dress underneath it that's stretchy and it's a little bit thicker. And the, the thing on the outside is sheer, but it ties in the front. Look at that. And you guys, this is really, really long. Look at that. Really long, but look at that pattern. I thought that the, the colors and the pattern was pretty. They had some other ones, but this was the one that I went with. And I think I'm just going to hold out on this and wear it like once it gets closer to spring, even though it's already hot out here. Um, but we're not going to get into that. Uh, and this was only $14.92. I also found, um, are they some jeggings? Jeggings? I never purchased jeggings before. I usually just wear jeans or I wear some leggings. I did pick up a pair of jeggings and they I wore them already so they're dirty. But they were black kind of acid wash look to them. And I was like these are not jeans. Like they were so cool and they were so comfortable. And I think I only paid like $9.99 for them at Walmart really really comfortable i was surprised so when i go back i will pick up a couple more but this dress was one of the things i picked up for 14 dollars. and then i have some shirts that i'll show you before i jump into the shoes so this first shirt also came from walmart now let me tell you guys i am a chevy girl i'm a chevy girl low riders trucks cars my car is a chevy i'm a chevy girl so when i seen this <laughs> i had to get it um i probably won't wear the hat i don't know the beanie i'm not too sure but i had to get this for the shirt and yes i got it out of the men's section most of my screen print shirts come from the men's section just because they tend to have i mean i'm slightly a tomboy so they tend to have the styles and the stuff on it that i like instead of it being like unicorns and real girly stuff i like stuff like this but it says american made chevrolet live fast and you know i'm tough like a chevrolet so i had to get this i just think it's super cute and i wear it with some jeans and then on the arm uh it says chevrolet and this is like thermal this is like thermal material and then the middle part is soft uh and like i said it came with the hat as well so you got both pieces and this was only twelve dollars and it says official gm product and so like i said this was in the men's section i'm not sure if i'm gonna wear this hat or not but if i do that's not bad to get two pieces for that one price okay i almost forgot this also came from walmart as well and it was a size large in the men's section and it says good vibes only and this is a bob ross t-shirt um i've been seeing him a lot lately on a lot of stuff especially around christmas when i was in uh where was i at fye for your entertainment store they had a lot of bob ross stuff but i got this because i just like the colors and i feel like it'll go with some jeans and then whatever color shoes i decide to wear that day pretty much can go with any color <laughs> but i do like bob ross and i like the little like hippie vibe to this and I can't remember, or is it on here? I don't remember how much this was, but it was from Walmart men's section. And I think it was probably like five or six dollars or something like that. But I did pick this up. The next couple shirts I did order from uh, Rule 21. And so they finally came in the mail. And so I did get this allergic to mornings. I just thought this was cute. It's just a little sweatshirt. Um, and I just picked this up. I cannot remember the price on this, but if I can find this on their website, I will link it down below. Um, it is in a double XL. I like my shirts to be kind of big. Um, yeah, plus also when you wash stuff sometimes, you know, it can shrink just a little bit. So just to be safe, 
I like to get a bigger size shirt, but allergic to mornings because that is definitely true. <laughs> This is one of my favorites that I got from Rue 21 and this is from the men's section and they are sold out after I purchased it and it came and I showed my daughter. She was like, mom, why you didn't get me one? And I was, I was like, oh, I didn't know you would like it. So I went back on the website to order it and they were sold out. I have not checked in a couple of days, but I will check if they are still on the market, then I will link it down below. But this is just um, <laughs> the instant Moroccan instant lunch sweatshirt and you know just just growing up always eating top ramen I just think this will be funny uh to wear I know somebody's gonna usually when I wear stuff like this I get a lot of people that's like oh where'd you get that where'd you get that you know just because and I like to wear stuff that's different so just because I grew up eating <laughs> top ramen and I still like it I had to get this shirt so this was from rule 21 and I think it was um I know it wasn't more than 20 but at the time that I got I think they were of course they were having a sale because I don't purchase anything on their site unless it's like two four or something like that so I think I spent $20 on this but I had to have this also, I don't know, I just wanted a Looney Tunes shirt and I liked all the colors in it. And this was from the men's uh, section of their website, Rue 21. And yeah, I don't remember the price on this either, but I think it was something like 10 or something or less. I don't know, but I had to get Looney Tunes. And then the last shirt that I got from Forever 21, when I seen this, I had to have it. It was on sale. Um, it was originally, the price tag says $32.90. But I think I got this for like $17. And when I seen it, <laughs> I had to get it. I just think it's super cute. It's just a yellow. I love the brightness of the yellow with the black and white checker. Plus, I got it because I have some checkered vans. And I thought this would be kind of cute to coordinate with my vans. And I like Hot Wheels. And I just think this will be so cute. And I know when Pooh Bear sees me in this, he's going because he loves Hot Wheels, he's going to be like, oh, my you know so I did this for him kind of but I do like the black and white checkered and when I make my purchases when I purchase uh, shirts and stuff I try to keep in mind all my tennis shoes I like to match my stuff so when I think of I, when I'm buying stuff or I'm ordering online or if I'm in a store I try to think of okay what shoes is this shirt gonna go with so that's kind of how I pick up stuff and that's why I ordered that but I love those colors and I had to have that Okay, so now we're into the shoes and I have five pairs of shoes. Yes, five pairs collectively hauling now. Two of them came from my sons and I'll show you those when I get into I'll tell you about that when I get into it. So when I went and did my walkthrough at Marshall's, I showed you guys these shoes and I definitely had to have them. <laughs> So it was these right here and I showed these during my walkthrough and I'm talking about, uh oh, I'm dropping the box. These gold and white ones that was only 40 bucks and I showed these and I was not going to leave without these shoes. I love the gold buckle on them right here. I love that the bottom, I don't know if you guys can see, but in this brown part, it has gold or you can see on the bottom. No, it's not picking up, but it has gold flakes all through the bottom of the shoe and I just love this style of kind of like a sock to where you can just kind of slide it on and go and I like these and do I have any all white shoes right now I have some all white converse some all white other two other pairs not completely all white but with all white and gold no I don't so when I saw these for 40 I definitely wanted to pick these up and so you guys know that I had to follow up with the black pair, the black and gold pair that I showed in that video. And these were also $40 and um, $39.99. And I also wanted to get these because I loved the black and the gold. And it does have the Puma sign back here. Um, I thought it was kind of like hard, but it was, it was actually a soft piece. So it's not like hard back here. Uh, and these are also like the sock that you slide in. They do have laces pretty much just for decoration because you slide your foot in here and I just thought these were really nice as well to have and the front looks like that and they are made up out of like a mesh so they're really flexible and everything 
really really comfortable when i put them on and so i definitely had to get these if you are looking for some running shoes if you're getting into working out or whatever check your marshalls because they got some really nice um shoes besides burlington burlington got some nice pumas too but i think marshalls pumas are a little more up to date than the ones at burlington so i mean you can find some good shoes at both of them but i will check out my marshalls first because they, they just have to me i think they have the newer styles not new they're still you know what i mean <laughs> not the newest or else they will be priced higher but you know what i'm saying <laughs> check out marshall's first <laughs> okay so these next two pairs now i was on the fence i had two pairs of vans in my shopping cart on the van website around Christmas and then I was I was trying to decide if I was gonna get the vans or if I was gonna get the Pumas after I seen the Pumas and so both of my sons you know my two oldest sons they're grown they told me you know cuz I ta I was talking to them they know I love tennis shoes and so I was telling them and so both of them actually purchased one pair each of the vans that I had cuz I had two on there so my sons bought these for me and I'm super grateful um, and yeah so that's where these came from and I'm almost on I'm almost having second thoughts about these because they looked a little different online than what they were when I got them and these are called ice cream glitter and I think they're cute but they just they're just a little different I don't know if I'm gonna keep them or not or if I do if I don't then I might trade them I know I'm gonna trade them for something else because they were a gift uh, but I don't know my sons like them so as you can see they are real sparkly look at that and if you remember my Kate Spade shoes from Macy's I love sparkly stuff um, but these are different. Look at that. So when you look at them, I hope this is picking up. Okay, there they go. Do you see all of that sparkle? That's what drew me to them. I love these. I got to hurry up because my um, battery is dying. But they're really, really cute. And I didn't know that they would be kind of like, kind of like sandpaper. Like, you know, that rough kind of feel. But they're really nice and they're different. And that's something that I like. I love items that are completely different or that I, you're not usually or used to seeing other people having. So, statement pieces that kind of stand out. And that's what this shoe is. I might just go ahead and keep it. But I wasn't, I didn't know when I looked at them online that they were this material. Um, I just thought they were sparkly. But aren't those cute, you guys? What do you think? Should I keep these? I'm waiting for it to focus. I don't know if that's focusing to you guys. I don't have my glasses on right now. <laughs> but I like those. I like that. And it has the vans in the black in the back. I mean, I wish they would have put that in white. But however, I got those. Let me hurry up because my battery is looking like it's going to give out on me. And then the other pair that I got. Okay, now these I'm definitely keeping. I knew I wanted these. And so thank you to my other son for getting these. And they are purple. Love my purple. So I had to get some purple ones. And then in here, these are called Jelly Side Stripe. And the reason why is because this inner part right here is like jelly. Or it's like a jelly texture. And it has gold. I mean, not gold, but silver flakes in it right here. And what color was the laces? It does come with purple laces. But I just had to have me some purple sneakers. Spring is coming. Cute, cute, cute. Uh, so I picked those up. And then the last thing that I just ordered from Macy's. I'm watching my battery. Uh, the last thing I ordered from Macy's, I had to have these. I know you guys would probably be like, girl. <laughs> but when I seen them, I wanted them. And like I said, I like to have stuff that is not the norm. Kind of out of the norm. And so, some money slides <laughs> at Macy's. When I did my walkthrough at Macy's, they were not in the store. Um, I did get an email later that evening saying that they was having a sale on shoes or something like that. So, when I seen these, uh, I had to have them. And look at that. Some big face slide ones. How cute are those? And they're glittery. They're sparkly. Look at that. I think it was this same time last year I bought my watermelon slides. You guys remember those? Super cute. Super, super cute. I still got those. Um, 
but yeah so i had to get these money slides and that is what i ordered so that's it you guys i'm gonna wrap this up before my battery died because i don't want to try to re-record this um let me look around that's it so let me know in the comment section down below what was your favorite shoe that i got out of the what did i get out of the five <laughs> and uh that's it anything that i can try to find that i do have i'll try to link it down below in case any of you are interested thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and i'll talk to you all in my next video bye